Despite the pandemic, Make-A-Wish Massachusetts and Rhode Island has continued to grant wishes for critically ill children during this time. Typical wishes usually involve travel, but wishes have changed amid COVID-19. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie explains how one Cumberland teenager's dream room design came to life. Bella Schwanier has been isolating for nearly a year due to her health condition. As a result, the 16-year-old spends a lot of time in her room, which she says hasn't always been easy. Staying home has a whole other meaning for Bella Schwanier and her family. We want her to be able to be a typical teenager and have, you know, be able to do the typical things. But Bella has cystic fibrosis, a genetic lung disease that makes it harder to breathe over time. At high risk for COVID-19, Bella has been staying home, taking classes virtually to stay safe. Before all of this, I was going through like a really bad depression and my room was a mess. Last year, Bella got in touch with Make-A-Wish Massachusetts in Rhode Island and wished for a complete bedroom makeover. I wanted a room that I could practice and be myself in and do the things that I love to do. For Bella, that's hair, nails, and makeup, but it's also a lifelong passion. So I'm hoping to go into school for cosmetology and open my own salon. Her new room was dreamed up by two Springfield designers, complete with a vanity and nail polish wall, plus a new gaming system. The silver lining to the kinds of wishes that we're making right now are that they're things that are going to last for our wish children and they're things that really require and, and include this full community support. Rhode Island State Police Sergeant Scott Hartwell was one of the volunteers who helped put everything together. There have been a lot of wishes over the years, but this is the first one where I've actually been able to do some hands-on work. Due to Bella's CF, they weren't able to meet face-to-face, -face, but Bella's parents texted pictures to Hartwell capturing the moment. It made it all worthwhile. Bella's mom, Amanda, says after the big reveal... Our Bella was back. And Bella says her room is more than she ever imagined. I have a lot of things coming back together. Right now on WPRI.com, my extended interview with Make-A-Wish Massachusetts in Rhode Island explains the most common kinds of wishes amid the pandemic and more details about how Bella's came to life. I'm Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.